Everyone is asking about these shelves. Here they are. I made them and it was probably the easiest thing I've ever done. So I'm gonna show you how to do it and then at the end of the video, I'm gonna post all the products that I've used so that you can replicate this bad boy yourself. Step one, measure the length of your wall. I wanted these to span the whole wall. I think this is seven foot and some change. Go to Home Depot and they will cut it right there for you if you have the measurements for free. And they're gonna ask you if you want the excess wood, say yes, because I did not plan to stain these because I like the natural wood look, but I stained my previous shelves. And you're gonna wanna use this as your stain sample because different stains look different on certain types of wood. So keep this handy. Once you get your wood, first thing you're gonna to wanna to do is sand it down. So it's gonna have minor imperfections on it like this and like that. Spoiler alert, I didn't sand these ones down. I'm not, I just don't have the materials here. Um, I plan on doing it in the future, but I'm gonna tell you what to do. Just get an orbital sander. You can use sandpaper, but the uh, electric one is a lot quicker. You're just gonna run, run it over the wood and get out any imperfections. If you do plan to stain it, the first thing I would do is buy pre-stained wood conditioner. So you're gonna wanna put like a coat of that on first, leave it sit for a couple minutes, wipe it off, and then apply your stain. Otherwise, if you apply the stain directly, it's gonna come out really blotchy. So the pre-stained wood conditioner just gives it like a, a nice even stain. To sum it up, all you really need to do is buy the wood and the brackets, screw them in the wall, and instantly hang the shelves if you want. You can get more detailed with it and do your own custom look if you want to, you know, stain it. But I mean, I just threw it up there and started decorating. It's, it's as simple as that. I do have a full detailed tutorial on kyliewhitespace.com. I have all the instructions listed out, all the materials you'll need it, and links to the specific products that I bought. So if you wanna take this one step further, head on over to my blog there and you can access everything you need to build these shelves for yourself. I also have a highlight saved on my Instagram at kyliewhitespace, so go check it out. I hope that helps.